This is Divine at Home with a bra and girdle. For some reason, has always been a fixation with John. I don't understand why, but he is obsessed by bras and girdles. Divine's breasts have been made out of many different things. The last ones were made out of foam rubber I could, for the simple reason that once... When traveling to San Francisco, we got the bright idea of I wanted the breast to actually move like women's breasts, so we made them out of lentils. And unfortunately, the lentils, when you compound them and to you know large breasts, end up weighing a lot. And he literally almost had a stroke on the airplane. We had to take him off because he suddenly lost his breath. He couldn't breathe. He said it was like a 200 pounds on top of him. Sound for. Uh -oh. okay. Okay. Polyester was almost Divine's Mildred Pierce. Mother, please, you know how cigarette smoke bothers my nose. <coughs> I can remember when I saw that one costume, the blue one that's in the accident scene, and the, the one that he and Tab run through the fields, and I looked at that and I said, Van, you will never get another job. That is the ugliest thing I've ever seen. Polyester was John's first attempt at a greater audience. John has always spoken to me in terms of, I want a certain amount of realism, he said, but Dreamland's Way, which was the company that he started. So Divine was to look like a housewife, but a John Waters housewife. I mean, I had costumes that didn't even need coat hangers. They'd stand up by themselves. You walk into my dressing room, your eyes started to burn. There wasn't a natural piece of fabric in there. It was just all petroleum. 